Oh, yeah. Late September, early October in New York. Tends to be my favorite time of the year because the weather is still warm, but there's not that summer expectation, especially when you go down to the beach, there's no summer crowds. And you can just hang out. It's like a private area. <laughs> Hi guys. See, the beard is coming in. All right, so I've broken the three week threshold, guys. This is the longest I've ever grown a beard and it's really starting to get to that stage where I'm gonna have to make a decision. Now, when I think about the beard I would love to have, the beard I want, it's a nice, thick, straight, full beard. And I'm not 100% sure that it's gonna work out for me on the sides here. Now, years ago, I had bald spots right here. And over the time, they've grown in. But as the beard starts to thicken out, I've got lots more depth here. And it's a little, little weak. So there are a few products that I'll be checking out that claim they can help you thicken the beard. And one of them is this right here from one of my favorite brands, Crema. This is their thickening beard wash. This is gentle enough to use every day, has a nice mild scent to it. I'll use it in the shower in the mornings. This should help thicken the beard, which helps nourish it and keep it clean. Now following a great performance by my boy, Dan Han, Daniel Hannon, Boston Strong. I, I just wanted to shave guys. And the King C Gillette products are so nice. I'm going to feature them today. The first thing I'm going to feature is their double-edged razor, three-piece double-edged razor that's designed or marketed for the beard wearer. It's marketed as an edging device. So let's take a look at this, guys. And the embargo is over. You can get this on Amazon. Link below, guys. This and the blades and some of the other products I'll show today from King C. Gillette fine products. Very hefty razor, good knurling up here, so it's it's slip proof. Nice balance. The Geek of Shaves does the whole balancing thing. I don't, I don't know if I have the skill to do that, but this is a nice balanced razor. Yeah, okay. But this will be what we'll be shaving with today. I'm going to take a a feather out of my boy Dan Han's cap, and I'm going to go with Clubman Pinot, their shave butter. And I'm going to attend to this next shave. We're going to be following it up by a little beard care maintenance. King C Gillette. Soft beard balm, guys. Moisturizes, softens, makes your beard manageable and just smells wonderful. We'll be doing that. And maybe we'll also be using this King C Gillette beard and face wash with coconut water. Smells fantastic. I just used it in the shower to clean the beard, use it multiple times a day. It's awesome, guys. These King C Gillette products are awesome. And now you don't have to wait or go to Walgreens. You can get them right on Amazon. Again, links below. You'll be doing something for you and something for the average guy. So without further ado, let's get started. Let's get started. Let's get started. Did I do that right? Okay. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do, guys, even though I've come out of the shower, I'm gonna heat up this neck area and I'll apply the hot towel or the hot cloth treatment. Almost hot water, guys. It just opens the pores and gets the neck ready to receive the shave. Clubman shave butter can also be used as an aftershave and we're gonna do that today. But it's a thick, paste here guys if you can see that and i'm following the two finger technique letting the beard grow down a little longer 
so I have the potential or the foundation if I wanted to go real full with the beard it's it's got the foundation to do that right now you'd classify this as a business beard I heard that from a viewer a business beard neatly cropped and managed we'll see what happens now I could put this on just a little thicker if I'd like to make it more visually interesting for the camera. It's probably too much. The butters have a, an oily base, so good for protecting the skin. There you go. I'm gonna be loading up with the King C Gillette blades, which are very nice, a mild uh, blade. My boy Jimmy G says, I believe these are Gillette Platinums rebranded and you can get the Gillette Platinums for less money is what Jimmy G is saying. Jimmy G will correct me if I'm wrong about that, but let me show you this. Very nice. Got the King C Gillette logo on it. So let's put that in the razor as my boy Dan Han would say. And let's get started. All right, hair on my neck grows upwards. I'm gonna go with the grain of the hair on my neck, 30 degree angle, shaving upwards. And I'm gonna be mindful of that line in the sand where I've let that hair grow down. No need to do too much here, guys. Gonna let the device do all the work. And with this edging and trimming safety razor, you've got good heft. So it's that much easier to just allow it to do what it's it needs to do. No digging, guys, just shaving. I would say that this is a great razor. If you're just looking to get into wet shaving, good set, nice, mild blade and a nicely balanced, just very nice razor handle and head. All right. First pass in the books, guys, I'm going to add a little water. I'll add a little bit more of this shaved butter because now I'm going to go with the cross grain pass. And that tends to be, if I'm going to have an issue, that tends to be where I'll run into some problems. So I want a little bit more protection. I really enjoyed the guest shave series. Thanks to all the boys who have stepped up more on the way. I've got uh, requests out to friends and creators. And if you're interested in doing a guest shave, look me up. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, at the Media Mart, or right here on YouTube. If you go to the About section, you can send me an email. Again, I'm taking my time. Very nice. All right, let's get ready for the third and final pass, which is gonna be an against the grain pass. Now this Clubman doesn't really have a scent. And after Dan Han's performance where he talked about the vanilla aftershave, guys, that's gonna to have to be on my list. The Clubman vanilla aftershave will definitely be next up order that on amazon today guys all right here we go last and final pass against the grain if my hair is growing up on my neck i'm going to take the traditional handle grip and i'm going to shave down again short strokes 30 degree angle let the device do the work I'm not even trying to get close to that hairline. I can touch that up later. All 
Adam's apple trick, if you, if you know the show, you know this, but for the newcomers, I have a pronounced Adam's apple if I want to eliminate it so I can shave traditionally and not pull the skin. So that's a technique. You pull the skin to the side, pull the skin to that side. But when you pull your skin, you have the propensity or you have the occasion to cut the hair too short and that can cause ingrown hairs. So a way to eliminate the Adam's apple is to swallow hard and just hold it. That uh, flattens this area down and then you can shave. So let's do that. Swallow hard, hold it. And then you can attend to that area. Now since the shave butter can be used as an aftershave, I just work that in and we're done. We're done with the shave, guys. Feels good. Now, I'm not chasing the BBS like my boy Jimmy G. But this is nice, it makes me look presentable and I'm ready for the day. A couple of spots if I wanted to go back and adjust or address, but it's good. Again, two fingers from the hairline to the Adam's apple. It's about where I am. Take that all the way around. Builds a nice foundation for a beard, guys. All right, let's get into a little beard care. Again, the King C. Gillette Beard and Face Wash. I'll just do a face wash for you guys since I talked about it. Coconut water, just a wonderful smell, guys. Just an amazing smell. Foams up nice. Now I use uh, less when I'm in the shower, but for camera, you know, it looks better to have lots of foam. And this is the foam you can get if you want it. Ah, yeah. Good guys. Looks good, feels good, smells really good. Now the final step before I go is the Soft Beard Balm, King C. Gillette. This stuff is wonderful, guys. Conditioning with cocoa butter, just wonderful. So I'll add a little bit of this helps to soften, condition. Oh yeah. Moisturize. The beard. And since I decided day one to grow the beard, I've been using these softening products the entire time. So I've put down a nice foundation of Really nice, soft, manageable beard. No beard itch as of yet. I'm in three weeks. Usually seven days in, I'm ready to shave it off. So looks nice, managed, nourished. Final step, I'll use my Cremo Boar's Hair Brush and I'll just brush the product in. This helps to straighten those fly away bits, but it mostly gets that product dispersed evenly. And there you have it, guys. A proper neck shave, nice, nice little beard care, and I'm feeling no pain. Again, this is a wonderful device. If you're looking at wet shaving, guys, get it on Amazon, have it shipped right to you. Links below, 
the embargo is over. Now, a little bit of maintenance for your shaving products or your shaving devices. Jimmy G says, you don't want to leave the blade in. So you want to pull the blade out. You want to wash. You want to wash the head or rinse the head with a mild soapy water or just warm water. Get all the shaving residue off of it. I'll let that air dry. He also does the same for his blades and he has a magnet where he puts the, the blade and he notes, this is Jimmy G, he notes the use, flipping it from side to side and on alternate days to get more out of the blade. I have a shaving channel, so I'm just gonna toss this and go on to the next one. But guys, again, the King C Gillette products are awesome. And I'm liking this shave butter, guys. Unscented, provides good protection. You know it's from a make that's been around for a long time in Clubman. So that's it. I'm going to get on with my day. I want to thank you all for watching. And if you're interested in doing a guest shave, hit me up. Hit me up, bro. Thanks again, guys. I'll see you next time, which will probably be like tomorrow or the next day. But in the meantime, you know what to do. Keep pushing play. Look at that, bro. Oh, the beard looks nice. It's coming in. Beautiful. If only I could find a way. Now, if only I could find a way to grow more hair on my head. To grow more hair on the top of my head. <laughs>